Located in north-central Spain along the River Ebro, Rioja is about 210 square miles of ideal winemaking territory. That means over 600 wineries and wine growers are packed into an area about half the size of Los Angeles. The region is divided into three large zones, Rioja Alta, Rioja Alavesa, and Rioja Oriental. Each town and terroir has its own personality and unique wines to discover. Rioja Alta extends from the River Ebro toward the Sierra de la Demanda. The terrain is fairly flat, with altitudes ranging from 400 to 600 meters above sea level. The Rioja Alta subzone is strongly influenced by the Atlantic climate, slightly colder than the rest of the Rioja region, with significant temperature oscillations between day and night, especially during the growing cycle. The Alabesa subzone is a narrow fringe bordered by the River Ebro to the south and the Sierra Cantabria to the north. The terrain is rugged with a similar Atlantic climate to Rioja Alta. However, unlike Alta, the Sierra de Cantabria shields the area from cold, humid winds that blow in from the Bay of Biscay. The Rioja Oriental subzone, formerly known as Rioja Baja, extends through the eastern half of the Rioja region. This subzone has a varied terrain with high mountains and expansive valleys. The subzone has a strong Mediterranean influence and is much hotter and drier than the rest of the region. With such distinct terroirs, wines from Rioja's various subregions each offer unique tasting experiences and varietals. The Rioja region is synonymous with red wine. Red grape varietals dominate the vineyards representing 91% of all grape varietals, and the king among them all, Tempranillo. The region's ideal growing conditions allow the versatile Tempranillo grape to be expressed in wine unlike anywhere else in the world. 80% of all vineyards in Rioja cultivate this grape, and for good reason. Tempranillo is often blended with other red grape varieties to create taste profiles that are entirely unique to the region of Rioja. While red grape varietals rule the land, Tempranillo's white grape relatives are grown all over Rioja as well. From Viura to Sauvignon Blanc, Rioja's white grape varietals are just as unique and exciting as its reds. In the land of Rioja, Tempranillo is king. But even with common grapes, not all wines are created equally. Rioja wines are classified into four distinct categories based on minimum barrel and bottle aging requirements. Each category has its own identifiable certification and seal to ensure the wine's authenticity and quality from vineyard through bottling. Cosecha is designed for young wines with little to no barrel aging. With less restrictions on the classification, winemakers have more flexibility in their winemaking process. Next, Crianza. Slightly aged with notes of delicate oak and vanilla, these wines are fantastic for any night of the week. Often a winery's flagship wine, Reserva Reds, offers soft tannins and luscious flavors, making for an excellent complement to richer meals and special evenings. Rioja's Gran Reserva wines are among the world's finest. Made from only exceptional vintages, they are ideal for elegant dinners and holidays. Regardless of classification, you can expect any wine from Rioja to be of the utmost quality. After all, they've got the credentials to back it up. In 1925, Rioja became the first Spanish wine region to obtain Denominación de Origen status. This term ensures that the wine complies with exacting standards that are certified by a regulatory board. But that's not all. In 1991, Rioja was promoted to Denominación de Origen Calificada, a higher category reserved for wines maintaining a proven consistency and quality over a long period of time. The DOCA is the highest recognition of quality in all of Spain. Rioja is one of only two Spanish wine regions to have earned this prestigious status. Need the proof? Just turn to the back of any bottle from Rioja to see the seal of approval. And if you think the accolades are great, just wait until you taste it. As you can see, there's a perfect Rioja wine for every meal and every moment. The only question is, what will you open next?